So in this video, we're going to take a look at all the different ways you can apply glitch effects fast in your project using Premiere Pro effects. So here we have just a few shots put together, little sci-fi feel, and we're going to add some glitches on this. We can do this a number of ways using Premiere Pro effects. So the first thing we're going to look at is our effects master studio. And inside there, we're going to have our heavy glitch and our light glitch categories. And these are going to have sound mixes attached to them. So if we highlight over, we're going to get a video preview of the glitches happening with the sound. Now the cool thing about this is the sound mixes are attached. So if I just double click on one of these effects, in Effects Master Studio, I can just roll out the effects and sound. And I'm just going to open up the sound here. And you're going to see we have a nice sound mix. And if I continue to roll this to the other end of the shot, the effect in the sound mix is just going to continue on. So as I play this, you can see that the animation of the glitches is occurring along with the sound effect. Take a look at another one. I'm just going to roll out the edges here and you're going to see where we have a totally different type of animation for glitches uh, including the sound effects. And these should go on for a good period of time, usually by default around 30 seconds so you have a good amount of animation along with the sound mix. And you can also just go up to the sound button here and check off if you don't want the sound. We can roll these edges in and make a faster type of glitch. So a number of ways we can do this. I'm going to delete this right now. And now we're going to take a look at Transition Master. And we're going to have some glitch effects in Transition Master. So a little bit different with transitions. We want our scroller to be in between two shots. And we just double click and that transition is going to go in between our two shots. And we can just play this. You're going to see you have a nice sound mix. I'm just going to move this over. And there's some nice glitch effects with sound effects for the transitions. Again, I'm just going to delete this. And now we're going to take a look at our looks and effects studio. And inside there, we're going to have our glitch effects builders, part one and two. And these are not going to have sound attached to them. They're going to be pre-animated effects that you can start to add and build your own glitch looks. So if I were to take something like this, and we're going to have this above our shot. I'm going to grab another effect, double click. So now we have these two effects on top of each other. And all I'm doing is double clicking on various effects and stacking them on each other. Now you can also get your razor tool or highlight C on your keyboard. And then you can just slice up the effect. And I'm just going to delete little parts of it. That way you just have momentary glitches sporadically. And again, the beauty with Premiere Pro Effects is that you can just mess around, experiment. Everything's ready made for you. So in this case, with looks and effects builders with glitches, you can stack and move around all different glitch effects really fast. It's all done for you. And all I'm doing here is just going through different glitch animations and stacking them on top of each other. And just experiment. There's no right or wrong way to do this. I'm just gonna move this down and I wanna have the scroller above it. I'm gonna double click. So now I have these two effects on top of each other and I'm just gonna trim this layer. And the idea with glitches is that everything is kind of sporadic and a mess. 
In this case, you can see some of these glitches. The animation will stop at a certain point, so I want to just make sure I'm aware of that. Other. And that's it. You have the Effects Master Studio, which has ready-made animation along with the sound mix that you can roll out and extend for about 30 seconds. Transitions. And then you have the looks and effects builders. So all different ways to apply glitches to your project. Really fast, really simple. All the work's done for you so you can create. Enjoy. Enjoy.